Hello everybody, it's Amar Sincilla and welcome back to my channel. Today I want to share with you a pork roast recipe that is super easy to put together, absolutely delicious, and it'll help you with your busy schedule. So let's get cooking. I have two pounds of pork shoulder that is cut into cubes. As you can see, the pork shoulder has some marbled fat in it and it's fine. That'll bring the flavor out in the pork roast. I'm gonna put in about one tablespoon of powdered ginger, three tablespoons of soy sauce, which is light soy sauce, one tablespoon of oyster sauce, one tablespoon of dark soy sauce, one tablespoon of sesame oil. Mix it all together. One tablespoon of peppercorns, drop that all in. And about seven cloves of garlic. Mix that all together. If you can marinate this overnight, that'll be great. The flavors will get infused in the pork. Add a cup of water so that it just covers the pork. Just stir so that all the sauces just blend well. And that is basically it. You can cook this on the stovetop, or in a pressure cooker, or in an Instapot, or put it in the oven. Since we want to free up our time, we want to put this in the oven at 350 degrees for an hour. At the half an hour point, we want to take it out, stir it, and taste it, and adjust the seasoning if needed. If you have a pressure cooker or if you have an Instapot, you can feel free to use that as well. The thing about it is adjust the water to what your pressure cooker or your Instapot um, requires. So let's cover this and put it in the oven. I'll see you in half an hour. It's at the half an hour mark. I've taken it out of the oven. I'm gonna stir it, give it a taste, and adjust the seasoning. Here it goes. Oh, it's, mm, it smells really good. Give it a stir. Taste it. I'm gonna taste the liquid as well. It's delicious. Perfect seasoning. I'm gonna cover it and then put it back in the oven. This pork roast recipe is one of the dishes that my mom taught me how to make when I started cooking at the age of 11. It is super easy to make and um, just simply delicious. You can use this as an ingredient in a lot of Burmese noodle dishes. One hour is up and the pork roast is ready. <clears throat> Here it goes. It looks beautiful. It turned out perfect. You can see there's still some liquid left, but that's okay, that'll be delicious. Here's your roasted pork and it'll go perfectly well with a side of white rice. Got my rice here. I'll just put a few pieces of pork. Get that delicious gravy on your rice. Mmm. It is so delicious. The pork is so tender and it just falls apart and melts in your mouth. The gravy is just perfect on the rice. I hope this video inspired you to try making this at home. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And if you haven't done so yet, make sure you click that notification bell so that you'll be notified of every new episode that's uploaded. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time.